Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I have my cutie pie, my baby girl. <laughs> and we're gonna be doing a wash and go on her 4A, type 4A hair. So yeah, stay tuned. You are new here. First off, welcome. I'm an old time sub the congregation, the rank gang, happy curl gang. Welcome back for another video. Okay, so if you guys don't know, it's been a while since I've had my daughter on my channel. Um, she has a life more than me. And mom, um, she's busy. You guys have probably seen the other videos, much, much younger, but now she's a big girl. It was blown out because of her graduation. She had a style where her hair was blown out. So it's kind of still in that state, but not really. So I'm probably gonna be out of the frame, but don't worry about it, okay? Her hair is very like soft and just very... Hey y'all, so I'm gonna go ahead and do a quick little voice over, okay? So I like to detangle her hair vertically with a dimming brush and then horizontally to kind of like give it some clumpage going. Um, this is just water, so her hair is really healthy. It just bounce backs with, um, bounce backs, bounces back with ease. Um, I use the Coil Enhancing Moisture Butter because it's nice and thick by Curl's Daughter. I also use it on my hair, but I find that using a thick butter on her hair when doing a wash and go really helps to prevent a lot of breakage. Um, her hair has gotten a lot thicker and um, she has a lot of shrinkage. So I like to use heavier products to try to help weigh down her curls a little bit, even though it really doesn't do a whole lot. Now, I don't like to use wet line extreme gel on her hair often, but for this video and with the protection that I have from the thick cream, I'm all for it. Um, I need something that's going to weigh down her curls. Um, her wash and goes are very easy to do. Um, like as you can tell, I'm just doing pretty big sections and then wetting it down. It's not even like soaking wet. I just get it wet and I go ahead and again vertically um, detangle and then horizontally I will create some clumpage. I don't have to do that really. I just like the dimming brush as y'all know. Um, then the moisturizer and leave-in is the Cocoa Curls. And again, I could just use this, but I like to use the gel just to weigh it down. I'm using As I Am Dry Itchy Scalp Care Olive and Tea Tree Oil Treatment. Her hair, or I'm sorry, her scalp does get a little dry. So I like to use this just to kind of give her some relief. And so now we're going to go ahead and finish up the style. Um, so again, I am just using a wide tooth comb. I go back and forth with the wide tooth and a dimming brush depending on the texture of her hair because she does have um, slightly different textures. And then I'm uh, going ahead and using the dimming brush like I stated before with the cream in it. And it's a breeze to pretty much detangle for the most part. I'm um, in the shower. Sometimes it can be a little difficult, but um, for the most part, not too bad. I don't go all the way up to the root when using the gel like I do on my hair. Um, but with everything else, I do. And that's pretty much it, you guys. I'm just going to go ahead and finish her wash and go. And we shall show y'all how it's looking towards the end. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. You heard him now, Gurgle. Hello. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay, vibrato. You better vibrato. I don't know where you get this from. Oh, <laughs> Definitely no. not me. You? You? <laughs> I don't know where you get that from. I get it from you. Don't be lying to the people. I'm not lying. You sing all the 
Praise God, Amen. As I travel away, yeah, I know you will. I know you will. Yeah, <laughs> that blessed me. Hallelujah. 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 Oh, we magnify the name of Jesus. Oh, we magnify the name of Jesus. Hey! Hey! We're gonna put some cocoa cream on your edges to moisturize them before we put on the edge booster. So like I stated in my flaking video, how to get rid of red, white residue and flaking, when you use butters, we don't experience any type of flaking underneath the edge booster. When I use a cream, I do. Same goes for her. So I use a butter and she's pretty much good to go. So this is how her, her hair is like a couple hours later. She has a lot of shrinkage. Her hair dries pretty fast. It was like a little damp in the scalp. Normally I just air dry and then I stretch, but for the purposes of this video, we didn't have all day to do all that. So I am drying her hair on cool air because she's really sensitive. She don't like when it gets like warm. <laughs> so it's real cool air. And then I decided to go ahead and kind of stretch it a little bit on warm. So like I said before, um, I just like to let her hair air dry. I don't like to use any heat or even a blow dryer. I just fluff as you're seeing and I just kind of make the um, stretch just kind of like on its own without using any type of heat or blow dryer. And this is how her curls are looking. Um, it feels really, really soft. Um, I don't like it to be super defined. I just think it looks really carefree and kid-like when it's now extra defined and whatnot. So I think it's really cute. It's soft. It feels really good. So she likes it. That's the <laughs> main thing. So yeah. <laughs> how you like it? Yeah, I love it. Tell the people how it feels. It feels so soft. I know, it really does feel soft. And it feels so curly. Shake them dreads. Shake them dreads. Shake them dreads. You wanna go, baby? It looks so pretty. That's so soft. So. Hey, come on, yeah. Hey, oh, all right. Come on. Huh. All right, so I like a full look on her. She um, has shrinkage, but shrinkage just means that you have healthy, healthy, healthy hair. So I try to have her embrace her shrinkage. I stretched it out a little bit just for like the effect, you know, the look or whatever, so that it can be a little bit bigger. I just like it to be like kind of carefree, not super defined and stuff like I would like my hair to be. Her hair likes pretty much everything. Her hair likes creams, butters, so that's excellent. Uh, <laughs> but her hair feels really good. She has a really good regimen, obviously because I'm her mother okay <laughs> so I try to take um, pretty good care of her hair so I think you look just absolutely gorgeous so thank you for being in this video with you me you're welcome <laughs> you needed it you needed this video <laughs> yeah let me take some <laughs> So it's a two. A Thank you so much for watching this video. See you guys later. Love you. Love you. What's for dinner? You cooking or no? No, Daddy's paying for the food. Sounds good to me.